The following are the solutions to the previous school day's homework. Students will get 100 points if they show all work for all problems. Students will get extra points for any correct answers they obtain. All student work is photographed before they check their own paper. The answer to number one is eight or negative six. Two is five or negative two. Three is two or negative ten. Four is two or negative fifteen. Five is negative six or negative seven. Six is negative five or eleven. Number eight, that should be a negative three here in this spot. So if you do negative 3 plus uh, 8, then you're going to end up with a positive 5 in that spot. Yeah, you're right. I think I've, I've missed two signs in here. It should be plus 8 and then equals negative 3. You're right. So that would be negative 3 minus 8, which would be negative 11 and then over here on this side uh, you're going to end up with negative 5 still so that's right and it should be negative 11 as well 7 is 7 or 2 8 is 8 or 4 9 is 3 or negative 10 10 is 6 or 2. If you need to see any of these, let me know which one we have to go back to. The following are extra credit answers for the assignment that was given as extra credit with the previous homework assignment. Extra credit answers are for number 1, negative 8 or 2. Number 2 is negative 9 or negative 5. 3 is negative 10 or 12. 4 is negative 11 or 6, and 5 is negative 3 or 12. These are two points each. Your test is tomorrow, and it will be designed to be just long enough for the time that you have before 7.50. So to factor a quadratic equation by completing the square is the test tomorrow. The following is an example problem. For your test tomorrow, you will have to fill in the blanks. I will give you the original problem and pieces of the work, but you have to fill in the blanks. The first step is to move the minus 22 to the right. So that means if this is blank here, you should have 22 as your first answer. And there will be a box there that you would have to fill in or it would have a corresponding problem number so that you could go to the answer sheet and put in 22. Alright, next up is to find half of the negative 9 and square it. So that would be negative 3. Well, not negative 3, but it would be 9 over 2, and if you square that, you would get 81 over 4. So there's another blank there that you could put in. And then on the right side, 22 plus 81 over 4. You could have two blanks to fill in there. Now we have to simplify. And on the left, we've made a perfect square, so that's x minus 9 over 2. You use x, the sign from the middle, and half of the middle term, and then you have to square that quantity. On the right... We have to have uh, 22 plus 81 over 4. A common denominator is 4. So if I multiply uh, 22 by 4, I'll get 88. So I would end up with 88 plus 81. And that is 169. 169 over 4. The next thing I have to do to both sides is find the square root. So another blank could be this as well as this. 
and then you could have the square root of the quantity squared x minus 9 over 2 and then the square root of 169 over 4. You'd have to find what the sign is that has to be there and the sign there, both are square root signs. Alright, so the square root of both sides will have x minus 9 over 2 and then the square root of 169 over 4 is plus or minus 13 over 2. You find the square root of the top, the square root of the bottom. Now we have x minus 9 over 2 equals 13 over 2 and x minus 9 over 2 equals negative 13 over 2. So 13 over 2 plus 9 over 2 is 22 over 2 which is going to be 11 and then negative 13 over 2 plus 9 over 2 is going to be a negative 4 over 2 so that is a negative 2 the following homework assignment is due on the next school day Students must show all work to get full credit, which is 100 points. Extra points are given for correct answers. The following is an extra credit assignment. It is optional. Students wishing to earn extra points can try the assignment. They will get points based on correct answers. Here is the extra credit if any of you want it. Congratulations, you have found the YouTube bonus, which is worth 20 points. Try the problem, show all work, do it on a separate sheet of paper. It will be asked for when we bring up the homework and the other extra credit. Thank you for watching this video from my classroom. Homework assignments can also be obtained at my website, which is www.skinnermoney.com.